Demoiselle cranes converge on a waterhole in Rajasthan. Refueling before the grueling flight back to their breeding grounds nearly 3,000 kilometers to the north in Mongolia. Over 100,000 birds attempt this migration that will take them over the Himalayas. Many die from fatigue, hunger and predation. Thousands more are killed by hunters. The small town of Kichan has become an oasis on their epic migration. At their peak, birds outnumber villagers by several thousand. It all started a few years ago when one man began feeding a handful of cranes. Cranes overcome their normal shyness and edge nearer. Now, up to 10,000 make the annual visit. When one takes the plunge, the rest quickly follow. Deserts offer little, so for people to give away food is a remarkably selfless act. All desert animals have to be opportunistic. scavenges on a dead cow in a stagnant pool. She feasts until a much larger male arrives. Young cubs suckle, their mother having finally fed. But they will require much more than this if they're to survive. Lions are not the only big cat to inhabit these deserts. Said to be more cunning than the tiger and fiercer than the lion yet so secretive it can live alongside people almost undetected. First light at a rocky outcrop surrounded by farms. Two eight-month-old leopard cubs wait for their mother to return from a night's hunting. Unlike the young lions, these cubs are clearly well fed. Their success is down to their adaptability. They will hunt virtually any animal, birds, insects, and even frogs. Such tolerance of even large predators owes much to a Hindu philosophy called Ahimsa, 
a deep-seated reverence for all life. She is a consummate killer with a notorious ability for stealth. Walking silently on her toes, setting her hind feet precisely in the print of her forefeet. The goat herder moves his flock on. The chance is over. 